This week's Ask Dr. Dury is an interesting and a very topical uh, question from a gentleman who wants to know, is it worthwhile to have DNA sequencing of my myeloma, full DNA sequencing of the myeloma cells in the bone marrow? The answer to this is yes and no. For research, the answer is an absolute uh, yes. We are extremely interested to know the full sequencing of myeloma patients and correlate that with the results of all the different types of uh, new therapies which we are using. However, the answer is no in the sense that we do not routinely recommend this because at the present time, we don't know what to do with this information. The results of DNA analysis have shown that myeloma has many, many mutations present. There are some recurring mutations which do indicate a poorer outcome and indicate to the doctor that some alternate treatment uh, is probably indicated to achieve the best results. One example is the presence of the 17P minus uh, mutation uh, detectable on fish. Uh, using sequencing, we can find that there are actually even mutations of this P53 gene which is involved. And those are definitely uh, strongly indicative of uh, resistant myeloma and a need for alternate therapy. But the big problem is that we don't have a specific alternate therapy to recommend right now, although we are actively looking for something really good for this particular subtype of myeloma. The additional point is that over time, many additional mutations occur, and particularly involving uh, RAS mutations, and those uh, undoubtedly will need uh, additional alternate approaches to therapy. And so, for now, the answer to this question is rather simple. For research, DNA sequencing is tremendously important. For day-to-day -day decision making, uh, we need more time. And so stay tuned. More infra information will definitely be coming along. And it is certainly hoped that within a few years, there will be specific treatment recommendations based upon uh, different types of mutations that are discovered.